We talk about it all the time. The economy can be a challenging, but especially for small businesses and charity organizations. But working together can sometimes be the solution. I spoke with Ravi Khanna of Elm Street Grill and Sally Kelton with Caring Services to see what they do and then also how they integrated things. Nice, nice. You, all, you always do it up, Ravi. You always do it up right. Thank you. Hey, let's talk about it. So these are some, some items on your menu that are fairly new. What, what are these? These look great. This is uh, a stir fry, but you can have an option of chicken, shrimp, or salmon. Uh, same as the case with the Thai basil. That's chicken, so you can choose what you like. And then, of course, everybody you wants You should try that. No. That's homemade I... Jack Daniel bread pudding. Oh, my gosh. He does this when I'm trying to lose weight. Thank you very much. Um, and, and tell, you know, you, you guys put your heart into this, this uh, restaurant and, and your soul and the food. Tell me about how your connection there with the restaurant. It's been, you know, it's more like that Cheers bar. Uh, including our staff, everybody knows their name. So when they're coming in, it's really welcoming uh, for uh, them to be recognized while they are at the restaurant. And then also, I'll talk a little bit about charity's pretty big with you guys too. Absolutely, like you know, we are uh, associated with a lot of them. Uh, every two, three months we do that. Uh, we had raised and sponsored a evening for a leukemia um, charity, and we raised close substantial amount of money. And the new one, we are doing it with Caring Services. And I have also invited Sally today uh, to talk oh, about yes. that event. Yes. Yeah, let's get over to Sally. She's got a lot to talk about. Can, can I eat some of this when absolutely, we're Absolutely, absolutely. Well, not right now. <laughs> we're going to wait a second. <laughs> All right, we're visiting with Sally Kelton now with Caring Services. Now, for people that don't know, what, what do you guys do specifically? We're a substance use disorder agency in High Point. So helping people get clean, stay yes. clean, right? And did you say, I think you mentioned before, they can stay at your facility for how, or be serviced for how long? Up to two years. Wow, that's great. And Ravi has donated before, right? For... Ravi has donated as a sponsor for um, a tea that we've had at the O'Henry. And we're having a tea in September, which is recovery month this September 9th at the Finch House in Thomasville. And these type of things are really just, I mean, without those, you couldn't function probably. You need that, those fundraisers. Absolutely. Yeah, very, very important too. And, and don't you think, talk about the connection with like local businesses like this that give back to you. What does that mean to you guys? For us to be viewed in the community and out in the community helps us tremendously. Otherwise, people don't know about us and they don't know how we help people and how important that is. And the difference that that really makes. That's Absolutely. great. So see, lots of reasons to support small businesses in our area. So, and this is something I think when, you know, small businesses have smaller budgets. So they work together and then they can make a bigger difference with that. So I know for like at Elm Street Grill, and he said, we do a lot of different charities, not just caring services. Caring services says we do it with other businesses too, but all of that kind of intermingling and it's almost like co-promotion. And, yeah. um, mm -hmm. and, and, it, and it works. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's like um, when uh, TV stations and radio stations kind of, you know, you guys have your, uh, your weather hits or whatever on radio stations. Yes. It's a nice cross promotion. I know this is a little bit different than what you're talking about, but um, I mean, every, there, there are different platforms for everything. And so I think uh, that helps. And let's be honest, none of us need another re reason to go to a restaurant, but Elm Street Grill, <laughs> that was really good. Yeah. I did have a bite of that. I just went to Elm Street Grill oh, not too you? long ago. I love the atmosphere and yes. the folks that work there as well too, but I love seeing, you know, um, organizations, restaurants, and different businesses coming together to help for a bigger purpose and a bigger need. It was great to see them kind of collab. And Caring Services does great work. They help um, people get clean from substance abuse, and they also help the families as well, so Very good nice. stuff.